My name is Richard Seff. I'm an estate planning attorney. Now I want to get specific about another plan that I offer. And this is really uh, germane to young families with young children. And uh, there are very, very, very few estate planning attorneys that offer this. And it's called the Kids Protection Plan. And it goes way beyond just naming who the long-term guardian's going to be if something happens to the both of you. It goes way, way beyond that. Let, let me ask you this question. What is going to happen to your child who you've left with the babysitter if the unthinkable happens? You've gone on a date and the unthinkable happens. What's going to happen that night? Many people don't know, but what happens is the police officer finally knocks on the door. The babysitter is frantic because they don't know what's going on. Uh, the parents haven't arrived home at the time they said they're going to arrive home. Of course, there's no response to the cell phone. They will have a protective services worker with them once they see that there are minor children involved. And it's quite likely that those children could end up in protective services uh, for a night or maybe even longer until the guardian situation is sorted out. That would be a disaster. Even for a night, that would be a disaster. So we created a kids protection plan that addresses these issues to ensure that your child will never end up in protective services and the way we do that is that we have you designate a first and second responder probably neighbors who live not more than 20 minutes away who have the legal documents that we've created that will give them the legal authority to hold those children until the long-term guardian can arrive so um, not only that but it provides instructions to whoever does raise your children about your philosophies of raising children, where you want them to go to school, what kinds of extra school activities you want them participating in, things that are important to you. So um, it also allows you to confidentially exclude anyone who you would not want raising your children. And that would go in a sealed, uh, that would be a sealed document only to be opened if it became an issue before the court, okay? And we also give you an ID card that's in your wallet so that if you are in fact in an accident, the authorities know that you have minor children at home and will know exactly who to contact and who has the legal authority to stay with your children?